Well, I'm here at the Chiron Higo stand here at NAB 2016. This is one of three videos that we're doing here this year, so make sure you check out the other two on the website. Uh, I've got Howard with me. Hi, Howard. Hi, how are you today? Yeah, very good. Uh, we're going to talk about Toolbox. Uh, so for those who don't know, tell us what Toolbox is and give us a little example of what it can do. Uh, the video got Toolbox is a software-based uh, scan converter. So it's what we call a scan converter reinvented. Um, it runs on a desktop PC and it has an SDI output card that allows you then to send a key and fill to your video mixer. Um, so if you have the toolbox in the top right hand corner of the screen, uh, we can find its uh, components. The first one is the grabber. This allows you to, like a traditional video mixer, um, sorry, traditional scan converter, select the full screen um, or if you wish to do so, you can create a region of interest and select the portion of the screen that you want to use. Um, Furthermore, we have the settings that allow you to do um, things like volume control, but one of the most important things is the delay. Okay. So you can also synchronize the audio with the video, and that's a one-stop shop going into your, uh, uh, into your mixer. Uh, additionally, if you wanted, you can use the system cursor, yes or no, or uh, upload a uh, cursor for your, uh, uh, for your overlays, and we have an image overlay uh, module as well. So if you're doing a Skype conversation and you want to show the Skype logo, you can then also upload the Skype logo and have that embedded into your okay. signal. Um, so again, a one-stop shop, SDI, grab the signal that you want, audio is embedded, image overlay, and you can send that out to us, uh, as a key and fill to the mixer. Um, so this can be used to grab web pages, uh, YouTube uh, pages, etc. Uh, one of the other features is the VLC plugin. So what we found is that a lot of people there are grabbing content, but they, they also would like to have, be able to just grab a file drag it over, play it back in VLC, and send it directly to SDI. Yeah. So that is one of the key features that we have in here as well. Okay. And the other one is the still store. So rather than dealing with uh, video, yeah. if we want to have um, uh, images uh, uh, in our SDI signal, we can also do that from the toolbox. Um, you can basically drag the images over and put them in a playlist. Yeah. This allows you then to go through them, double click, we'll send them on air. Um, if you wish to do so, you can also go into edit mode, and this allows you then to resize, reposition the image as well. So let me just quickly uh, uh, re resize one of them, reposition it, because a, a new feature of the toolbox is also the keyframe animation that allows us to do things such as the famous Ken Burns effect. So we can then go in, have this image up and running, and I can then say I want it at the end of the uh, um, uh, animation, I want it to be slightly to the right and zoomed in. So now it's going to take it from its first keyframe position over to the last keyframe position and send it out on air for us as well. And in uh, one of the most hot um, items uh, and additions to the toolbox this year is what we call the return signal management. So using the grabbing tool, we can grab Skype, um, um, Google Hangouts, these type of video conferencing tools. And using this return signal, we can also decide what we want to send back to the far end. So the system has an SDI card, as I mentioned before, for the SDI key and fill. But it also allows you to input an SDI signal. And that SDI signal gets then transferred through Skype, Google Hangouts, any video conferencing tool, basically, back to the far end. And then we can decide on which audio channels we want to send, which video channels. And we have an override mode that allows you then to interrupt audio or video as well. Um, that's Toolbox in a nutshell. That it sounds fantastic. Um, the availability of this? Availability of this, well, you can just go to our website um, and visit chironhigo.com and go to the uh, Vidigo section, and it's called the Vidigo Toolbox. Thank you very much, Harold. Uh, go and have a look at the website. Uh, link is on screen now. You want to find out more about the Toolbox, you'll be able to find it on their website. Don't forget to check out the other two videos we've done here as well at Chiron Higo stand. You want a bit more from NAB 2016, of course. That's on our website, kitplus.com.